All right. Hello, Ava. What's going down right now? We're making a statue, a statue? Uh, out of mushrooms yes. in the shape of our friend Shane here, hey. who we just recently uh, pulled from their plastic cocoon. <laughs> and now you can see we're stuffing their bust. And when we're done, we're going to have a beautiful uh, immortal mushroom bust of Shane. You can even see the arms there. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> Shane uh, placed their hands in such a way that we can make offerings to the mushroom statue. Nice! So, <laughs> we're really excited about this. So if you know of any uh, tables that are in need of, you know, a mushroom statue, mm -hmm. let us know. Like a great centerpiece. So what, is, so what exactly, <laughs> now you have this wrap, uh, this casing of, of Shane here, in your, what are you stuffing in there? We're stuffing Pluritus Austriatus, donated by Smugtown Mushrooms. Awesome. Um, and so wherever we cut holes in this statue, uh, little mushrooms are gonna fruit out. Nice. Yeah. That's awesome. So you got a little bit of some wood chips here. Yeah, I got some hardwood chips that we soaked. Nice. Um, there's lots of different substrates you can use. We're using these hardwood chips because it's what's available. Mm -hmm. You can also use sawdust or straw. Right um, and you can make many different forms of the statue, many different shapes. And so I encourage you to try it at home. You can also do something more sustainable like paper mache. Mm -hmm. You won't be able to see your mycelium uh, beneath the the mache, but it'll be more sustainable when you poke holes in it, it'll still fruit out of it. Question, Ava, why, why is it more sustainable? Uh, paper mache, because paper is more uh, disposable, or more biodegradable than mm. plastic. Mm -hmm. yeah. Unless these mushrooms... Oh, you mean for the shell, I guess. Yeah, oh, the shell. I thought you meant... Yeah, yeah, I thought you meant... Yeah. Nice. Yeah, this is really awesome. So, yep, 2016 Radical Mycology Convergence, making sculptures with fungi. Can we get a Radical Mycology? Radical Mycology! Awesome.